Well, I mean, the first batter of the game has a great approach, drives the ball the other way, and, and gets you a quick point to play downhill baseball. That's what we're all about. And, um, you know, Robbie took it from there. I know we had another solo home run, which was real nice, and then a hustle run where I thought we ran the bases exceptionally well. But the day was paced by Robbie. On a night where we really needed it with a bullpen that might have been a little bit tired or short in certain places, Robbie gave us seven great out or seven great innings. He really didn't even seem to get in any hot water. Um, I, you know, the 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 biggest problem he had today was a few. I think it was four or five three ball counts, and I know he struck out three of those batters, and that's really nice where we can kind of set things down and, and just watch and enjoy him go to work and do his thing, and the bullpen picked it up from there. And so once might. again, he's good on the road. It seems to be a trend where I think his road ERA is point eight one. Well, see, I didn't know that much, but thank you. Um, I know that he's been very effective. He's doing his job for us, and that's the bottom line. And then, like I said, on a night where we really needed him to step up and give us an extended out, he did a great job. Well, well, it seemed like one of those nights where he was just challenging guys with the fastball, and they really couldn't do much with it. Well, you know, he felt uh, he felt very good with several pitches from my vantage point. He, could, he was going to the slider curveball uh, from time to time, but really when he needed to stand on his fastball, I think he was saying, here it comes. And... Uh, do your best to catch up to it. He's beaten some very, very capable hitters with, a, with an aggressive fastball. And for me, when things like that are swing and miss, you know he's having a special night. And you also continue sort of the trend of starting off these trips with a, a, a good game one. All right. Well, that's what we want to do. We want to set a tone. We want to make sure that we're ready to play. And um, our guys have done a good job of that. And I know the last two series on the road, we've kind of slumped after winning the first game. So I know these guys are always ready for a good challenge. Whether they're aware, aware of that or not, I'm not certain. Uh, but I know we'll be ready to play tomorrow. Was uh, Goldschmidt okay on that play uh, when he stole home on the wild pitch um, and he was uh, like backpacked off him? I, I think he was fine. I think, um, you know, that's a steady moment for this ball club. I think Goldie doubles, steals third base, really on the first pitch. Uh, great recognition on his part and then got us an extra run, which was extremely important. But yeah, he came through it no problem. I know the play looked awkward, um, but he's a strong, strong guy. He got up and he felt fine. So the phones were down? Was... Phones were down, so un unlimited replay. And I, I guess I didn't get the definition exactly right. I thought it was going to be unlimited timing-wise, mm -hmm. uh, is what I thought, because everything was down. We were going to be able to take our time over the 30-second time limit. But they said unlimited replay, period, so we could go to it as many times as we wanted. So that was that was made clear to me when I raced out there after their first um, their first replay was a loss. I thought they had lost it for the day, but that wasn't the case.